Hi Packet Gamers, my name is Blue Venom and welcome to my Minecraft new series. This series will be called Bedrock Guide as you can see to our word name. That's what we are going to name our word. And in this series, I am going to teach you every survival guide on Bedrock Edition. So, um... Let's hop on through the settings. I'm not making any seeds, so it will be all random. We can get the starting map and bonus chest right away, but for the sake of this guide, so that we can we have zero items on our inventory to teach you guys how to start your five minutes in your survival world this is the uh, right way or i think the right way this is my personal guide on what should you do in your five minutes on your bedrock survival so the friendly fire is on and i think the the normal settings will be there so i'm not gonna get the coordinates on because i wanted to show you some other stuff that doesn't include seeing the coordinates and let's just take it as is as it is and the uh, the cheat so it's also off as you can see there it's all uh, not available for us so let's gonna let's go go and create our new word so and we are now in the start of our uh, Minecraft survival. The good thing is we spawn above a tree. We can actually use this tree as our starting wood materials. This is the uh, obviously the uh, most needed one and the most common one. You need to gather as many woods as you can. So um, in the first uh, five minutes, you might want to uh, gather all the supplies that you need. I'm just gonna mark this uh, this up. So that I can remember where the uh, where the spawn is, and let's just go, go get. Let's see first if the the tree is not that big, so that we can cut it all the way through, like this one. There are also some other stuff. There is actually six stuff that we are gonna tackle that you need to do in the first five minutes in your gameplay. So after that, I think you are set for your survival, survival world. So uh, make sure to do all of this stuff in five minutes or in before the uh, night day comes. So this is the other one. Get kill all the ships that you can call it kill all the ships at least three ships and uh, all the all the cows that you can see in your site because uh, getting three walls actually make you survive your first night in minecraft because uh, minecraft uh, is kind of easy game to uh, do if you know what you are doing if you get three wool already you are basically set for that you you wouldn't need to kill more and also you need to kill kill the cows because of the food i think um for me i believe uh this steak is the most easiest food uh, resource for the for the starter and after i cut this wood i'm gonna see through some um mountains or cave to get some wood so uh, after we go there i will show you how to how to do it next so there's a mountain here that's showing its stone. This is what you are need, gonna need to do. So there's also this. This is also nice if the if the stone ba variety is already showing in your in the caves. But I think there's no coal there. But anyways, I'm gonna go for this one because there's a high chance there's death. Yeah, there we go the coal the coal is what we are finding for you need to get those coal and craft your very first crafting table so uh, in, uh, building your crafting table it's easy you just need to uh, get some woods not like that get some woods first and after that you craft the crafting table and you're set for life you're, you're only going to build this item the the uh, wooden pickaxe 
Uh, just remember my don't make any other tools from wood just make a wooden pickaxe and um, this uh, make it uh, make it to destroy immediately by uh, getting some of the stones and getting this coal so that you can have some lighting in the caves when you start mining in the next few minutes so this is the coals and uh, make sure to use all your use the all the durability of your uh, wooden pickaxe to the stone and get as much as you can so that your first mining session will be will be much efficient so i, I think in the next episode i will cover what you will going to do in the uh, first mining session that you'll do i'm gonna go there and use all the stuff that i gather in this first episode and i will show you how to uh, go on caves without ever get uh, getting lost some people get lost in caves because they they uh, I, I don't blame them because caves is really like a maze for most people especially for the beginners and they don't they don't really tend to uh, be friendly with the new players if they don't play the game before so next one to do is make a makeshift house you do not need to get fancy house immediately you just need somewhere to stay and for me i think this cave that i'm doing is a good start for a house so i'm gonna make a makeshift door i'm gonna make a doorway here and probably a torch immediately because it's getting dark at my back and that's the reason we get the torches for the uh, immediate lighting and that's all that's all it is so i'm gonna make a what you call that a staircase down so that we have a nice way to go the up and down to this uh, makeshift house and get this crafting table this crafting table is, is going to be needed upstairs and i'm gonna place this crafting table in the front of my doorway i don't want to put this uh in the inside because i'm not going to live in this cave for a long time i just need a place so that i, I can start i can put some chests and some starter items uh, after my uh, first cave session so uh, i think i think this will be enough but let's let's uh make it more wider because i have the pick the wooden pickup still but uh, at the moment it is gone and it's now time to craft your new weapon yeah it's you can now upgrade it to stone because you now have stone and you don't need to craft any wooden uh, tools at the moment so i'm just gonna widen this up up to here so that we have some wider space in our first house and craft the bed, the bed that we need so crafting a bed will be easy so you just need three wooden planks and three wool the three wool is what we gathered earlier also getting that three wool we managed to get five raw mutton so uh, it's uh, probably a good idea to uh, make a furnace to smelt it up so even if it's five it's uh, still worth it for your first day so uh, we have all here and i think we just need some torches right over here so that we have some light in the inside and craft our double chest so that we have some kind of storage in here so your inventory will be free up so let's just make one double chest so that uh we 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 can be always reminded that it's not this this house is not permanent and this is the spruce uh, door of course we need this spruce door for uh, minor protection for the house and after that you need to go go on and and get some wood so it's a good thing that we managed to get another set of coal in the 
in the mountain i'm just gonna crop some stone axe because this uh the rest of the five minutes will be held into mining this uh wood so if you find a coal lying around you you i suggest you get it immediately because it's uh, probably critical for you to have uh, this important stop at the start of your survival at and at as you can see i think I, I managed to showcase you guys the how to start the your very first minecraft board as you can see we already set for the night we have the bed we have the room we have some um, cobblestones and rocks and um, coal immediately so it's it does it do not take any much any long time to do that you just need uh, the right mindset to be able to have those stuff so anyways I think I managed to clear all up all the things up that you need to do in your first five minutes you just need to continue on and get some woods and you're probably set for your first night so the night is still not yet arrived as you can see the and we we managed to get all the stuff that we currently need and yeah, I think in the next episode, we are covering your first mining session on what to do on your first mining session and what not to do. And I think that's pretty much it for this video. So, I think I'm just gonna look up and find the sun where it's currently located above the ground. I think the, the sky is getting a little bit of darker. I think the night time is about to fall and and we are good to go for our next step of survival world so do not rush this do not uh, skip i i mean do not skip all of this stuff in your first day in minecraft because if you step at if you skip at least one of this you you will get you will get troubled and uh, get confused on your minecraft world so if you don't have the stone you'll have a hard time getting a uh, you'll have a hard time having some stone stuff in your um, wooden uh, tools in your inventory if you don't have a coal you you have a hard time in lighting up your first uh, base or your first mining session if you don't have wood of course you you cannot craft most of this thing you probably get it right you you need to do this or else you have you get your hard time starting your survival so uh, anyways if you also another one if you uh, manage to get a cow the cow is better than this mountain the cow the uh, steak that you cook from that it's better than this uh, mountain but anyways this is still a rad good food and you manage to sleep for the night so thank you for watching my first episode in bedrock guide i hope you like it and i hope i see you on the next ones and i hope you learn a lot from me so uh, for now this is all i got time for you today goodbye guys